Next up is Frances Nagel. Frances, are you here? She's not. Do you know her at all? Uh, yes, she's in Italy. She's in Italy? Cycling. Cycling? Well, herself. It's sad that she's not here. So this is her poem, Frances Nagel, Pilgrims. They call the visitors who go round to all the houses on New Year's Day to wish everyone a happy New Year, Pilgrims. I'm sure you're familiar with this um, custom in <coughs> Scotland, Northern Ireland for sure, and perhaps the North of England, of first footing on, um, on New Year's Eve, which of course was a, a much more significant holiday for a long time than uh, Christmas. In Britain, it's a dark-haired man with a lump of coal first foots good fortune into our homes. We draw a reverent breath as we open the door. For a brief, pure time, we may believe. This interlude is sanctified, unspoiled, so clean it runs us away hand in hand with hope until it bumps against the world's pain. So fast, and the flow of cruel days rushes on regardless of how we try to damn it and send out help. Never far away is the one we don't talk about, who'll arrive in his own time and let himself in. That's Francis Nagel, Pilgrims, and we'll be sending on uh, this little envelope to Francis Nagel. <laughs> 